Hello everybody and welcome back to more Let's Play Link's Awakening. I am the Quesadilla, and in this episode we're taking on level 2 Bottle Grotto. Alright, so let's go ahead and get started. How's everybody doing? Uh, it's April... What? April... I don't know. I can't really think right now. Oh! No, oh, go, 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 go. Already I'm messing up. <laughs> uh, <laughs> okay, so ahead of time, I apologize for the coughing. Yeah, I'm a little bit... I got a little bit of a head cold. What am I doing? Okay. Yeah, see, so if I mess up or if I'm, like, coughing and you guys are getting sick of it, you know, I'm sorry. Oh, oh. Go ahead and go in here. Destroy the keys. <coughs> um, so, <coughs> um, for whatever reason, when I was a kid, this place used to always give me, like, such a hard time. It always confused me. I just... I don't know. I don't know what it is about this place, but when I was a little kid, it just... It didn't go well for me. But we just got the map. Let's, uh... Let's look at this. It looks like a jar. Huh. Like a... It's a, it's a bottle, maybe? Because we're in bottle grotto? Huh. 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 Wait. Where... Yeah. Okay. Never mind. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I was kind of worried there for a second. I was like, did I get on the right file? And I was like, wait, if I was on, if I wasn't on the right file, then, yeah. Then, then yeah. that's just great commentary right there. Go ahead, Chris. Just, you know, see out all sorts of good commentary. So in this dungeon, we have something new here. These little switches. When you hit them, um, it'll. Certain switches that are down will go up, certain switches that are up will go down, like that. <coughs> Not switches, blocks. Certain blocks. And, um, sometimes it can be a pain in the butt, like in the last dungeon of the game. There's only one spot where you really need it. Get over here. Get... Okay, so, can you please, sir? Oh my gosh, yes, I know, it looks pretty heavy. I won't be able to lift it with just my bare hands. I just want to... Thank you. Gosh. So in this room, we get the compass. Yay. Even though there's not really... I, I, I'm doing this just because to show where it is and to show you, like, those little shy guy dudes. I know that's not their names, but... Um, well, not in this game, at least, but... Um, as you can see, like, he followed my, like, he copied, he, not mirrored, but he was doing my movements in reverse, I guess is what you could, I'm just gonna go with mirrored. <laughs> words, to, I don't like words, they don't like me, but we're gonna deal with it. So we can open a locked door, yay! Hit that, go over here, go up here, quite a few keys in the dungeon, actually. So now there's two of these guys, so yeah, see, they kind of... They kind of mirror your movements, which can get annoying sometimes. I, for the life of me, never figured out that, oh, I can charge my sword, walk backwards towards them, and then hit their backside. And the switch is there. <coughs> oh, oh, man. Do I have... I never got bombs, did I? I'm allowed to get bombs right now, right? Jeez. Here I am, this is my favorite game, and I don't even know when the bombs come... Oh, I'm so dumb. What the hell? But anyways, go up here, going this way, find one, spiny, spiny, spiny. <coughs> Defeat the spiny, open the door, and let's, oh, never mind, I thought it was a, I know it looks heavy! Shut up! Gosh, how many times am I going to have to go through that text? It's a good thing we're gonna be able to not see that anymore after this dungeon. Thank God. Jeez. Most annoying thing ever. Got our rocks feather. Parkour! Parkour, parkour. Oh, I almost made it. Usually if you're fast enough, you can go ahead and, like, jump up there. That's pretty cool. Did I already pass it? Oh, no. Did I? Wait. No, 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 no! Oh, no! Damn it. Jeez, I have the worst luck on this thing, I swear. Alright, so mid-boss time. Let's go ahead and charge up your sword. This guy will throw bombs 
after you hit him. This guy used to be the bane of my existence with this game. Because, like, <laughs> eventually, like, if you're too far from him, he'll, like, run at you and grab you <laughs> and throw you and he'll take, like, a whole heart of damage. And I, for the life of me, just could not beat him. I don't know what it was, but, yeah. Anyways, four swords fantasies out of the way. Okay, so here it is. So, as you can see, there's a staircase in there, but we can't get to it yet. And then right up there at the top, there's a stone slab. And over here in this room, walk inside. Oh no, it's a vortex trying to suck us in. It wants to... No, 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 no. Damn it. It wants to suck us. That's what I was trying to say. No! No! Oh, thank God. I found a fragment of a stone slab! Now you can read the message on the wall. No, no, no! Oh, well, that's okay. I was going down here anyway. Fine, then. I pushed the button. I swear, I pushed the button. First, defeat the imprisoned stuff Pole's voice. Last, stop voice. I wonder what that means! <laughs> well, we're about to... No. We're about to find out right now for ourselves. Keys. 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 <laughs> 20 rupees make me jupees. Oh, drop, drop my headphone. Jeez. Oh, man. It's so organized. Uh, I have a cough. I'm snivelly. Okay, so now, in this one, we have booze. Boo. Boo. Why are you scared? Why are you crying? There we go. So go ahead and they either let him go off the screen or light one of the torches and attack him. You only gotta light one and it's fine, but we found the power bracelet! At last you cannot read annoying message text text boxes that come up whenever you touch these. Oh. Whoa, that was weird. Yeah, see? So now we have it equipped. Yes! Well, that was annoying. I'm really sorry. My phone, which I record on, decided... Oh, by the way, you can't record anymore. <sighs> Anyways. Gosh, what else? I want to say anything? I'm not going to say anything. But I need to go... Hit the... Hit the crystal switch. Am I gonna have to... <sighs> this is really annoying. This really is. I... <sighs> what the hell? What the hell? What the hell? Why, no, why am I trying to defeat him? We need to defeat him. We need to hit this and then go back. Wait a second, 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 I'm so stupid. Why can I get the out of here? Why didn't I think of that before? Now that I have the bracelet, I can just go and... Well, I needed to show this off anyways. Well, I didn't need to, I wanted to. Okay, never mind. I was gonna try and get that heart with wings, but anyways, piranha plants. Another Mario reference. Another one out of many. <clears throat> so just kind of jump on him. Aha! Gotcha. Yatch. Oh yeah, we already read the stone slab. So in here. As you just heard, there's a little boop 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 doop. I just messed that up already. Damn it. Go in. Go out. Anyways. Really. Really? Really? I have the... 
So, as I was trying to say, in this room, there's a Pole's voice. Yes, and that's the little bunny rabbit right there inside. He's in prison, so obviously he's a Pole's voice. <laughs> and then, there's a Stalfo, which likes to keep following me, apparently. So, the only way to defeat a Pole's voice, if you don't have it, is bombs. Apparently, um... Like, the only way to defeat them is with noise, and bombs, you know, they make a loud, exploding noise. So, either destroy them that way, or... freaking Stalfo, get out of the way! Get out of the way! What are you doing? What the hell? Get out of the way! Oh my gosh! Are you serious right now? Thank you. So, Pole's voice, keys, Stalfo. Now, for whatever reason, for the longest time, that was the part that annoyed me as a little- that I didn't get as a little kid. By the way, we get the nightmare. Key. I never got that as a little kid. For whatever reason, and we need to go back this way if we can get that one down the key. But, I could not get it. I could not get the fact that, oh, there's a key in here too, I should probably destroy him. For whatever reason, my tiny little brain could not fit that together, and just, yeah, and I'm sorry if I sound aggravated, I kind of am a little bit. Destroy the keys, thank you. Put you off the edge. Destroy you. <sighs> why? Just why? All this stuff. Just, <coughs> all this stuff. Coughing. My phone decides to die on me in the middle of recording. <sighs> oh, never mind. Come walk across that. Okay. Now I just need to calm down because I'm more annoyed than I should be because I shouldn't be at all. But the music is getting really annoying now. For you. Destroy you. No. No. Destroy you. There we go. There we go. <coughs> oh, no way. I'm gonna... Oh, that's so cool. I'm so happy right now. Because the boss... He's not really hard. He's annoying. But I have a piece of power to defeat him. So... To help me defeat him, that is. So... Should be good. Hopefully. Alright, let's see how this goes. Ho oh. oh, ho ho! I'm your bad guy this time! Ho oh, ho ho! A bottle is my bad guy? That's, uh, really... What the... Balls? Nya nya, you can't hurt me so long as I have my bottle! Yeah, bottle crawl right there. Oh, okay, so... This guy is actually pretty simple. And then... Pick him up! Yeah! Throw it at the wall. And then... Same text for three times. Three, three, three. That's all this ever this game ever is. That's all any Zelda game ever really is, honestly. Actually, not every. Because there are some times where it's been like five. Like, I noticed in um, <coughs> Oracle of Ages and Seasons that it's like five on bosses. On some bosses. Which... I'm in the middle of playing, um, Ages right now. I'm really liking it. Although I'm at the part where it's like the Goron dancing. For whatever reason, I'm having a hardest time with it. Just, you know. Alright, so, one more. Yeah! What? You, you broke my bottle! What? You, you make me hopping mad! Start then. Ooh. Yeah, one more should do it. What? There we go. Yeah! Mm. Sorry, I had fun. <laughs> Got a new heart container, bringing us up to a total of five hearts. Sorry. <laughs> Read that wrong. Anyways. You've got the conch horn. Prairie. Prairie. The 
prairie is waiting. Thank you guys so very much for joining me. I have been the quesadilla, and next time, we'll see what happens. Hope you guys have an awesome day.